Absolutely. Launch all the power. So that's that confirmation split. Tanak 1.3 down at 22 Ks. Stage 29. <laughs> Sorry, he's looking at the split from Great Britain right at the start of the stage. Wow. Uh, when you consider that it was Elvin who was fastest at the by one and a half seconds over Cali. Neil Cole is at the stop line for us. We're going to be hearing from the drivers shortly. Let's head out there and uh, join him. second pass through, tell us how different the conditions were, it looked like you got a good time there. Yeah, it was uh, difficult still. Uh, the line is not so wide after the small car, so yeah, basic story, I need to open the line a bit and uh, it's not easy, but uh, but yeah, it was a bit more dry than I was expecting, so for sure at the middle of the stage it was uh, really slippy when it got uh, quiet. Which is this section that we're at right now. the rest of it later or do you try and manage it I, I, I think it's a situation you've got to take what you can when you can and just then hold on for dear life in the it, when it starts to go a bit like tire wear is critical it's a huge split wasn't it from uh, Elvin Evans at the end he completes the stage he's 7.8 seconds up on Neville 8.8 for Long Hera and Tanak which means Evans is ahead of Tanak overall now Four seconds down at the final one. We've got all the soft oh, yeah, lines of Italian and Hayden and Patton all within the stage right now. Welcome along. Two right to touch, one sharp. Four left, double tight, square. Southern tight, one right. Into weight, two left, half. Narrow. Repeat, hairpin right. 30 hairpin right. Open. Stop, tight, too sharp, and tight, hairpin left, half, right, one left, jump. It is so twisty in this final sector, isn't it? Yeah, it's just, yeah. And the left damp there, obviously, because we're down. in the trees here. Tight, three right, half, left, open, stop, one right. It's like what green, green swim, oh shit, what can they do? Yeah, oh shit, he's doing quite a bit at the minute. He's, uh, in comparison to Elvin, 5.1 seconds faster at 17 k's. That's what we're talking about. So 3.4 up on Bream, 5.1 up on Evans though. Let's head out to the stop control. 
Matka, when we spoke at the end of the last stage, you were scratching your head about why you couldn't find your rhythm. Have you found it? Getting a bit, yes, but quite, uh, let's say, no mixing function. In the beginning, it's okay, then at the end, you have uh, one and quite easy section, so it was not so easy, but it's all good. It's got the wipers going here. It's absolutely blow dry, but we did see some spots of rain on the camera from the helicopter. So that's uh, that drizzle coming back in. You kind of just knew OJ once. Oh no! We'll keep you up to date with, with Craig's progress. I don't know whether he's going to be able to get out of that. He seems to be completely surrounded by trees. There's no damage on the car. It's just surrounded by trees. Got it. We had a real big ding dong battle going on, didn't we? They're slowing Gus down. Just that's the point where he's got off his just down there. Paul was on a cattle grid, so they're obviously still not able to get that car anywhere near. Understandably so. And that is the car then. And it's just. Uh, we saw, like you say, Elvin. It's trying to fight your car. It's, it's, uh, but it's the wheel off. It's the front. Oh, no, no, it's a person in the wheel arch. Oh, there is a person there, yeah. Yeah, so I didn't hear I could just see an empty space. I was like, what? Well, they, they're trying they're to run from you, but first of all, what can you tell us about where Craig went off? Uh, so, like a. I left that open, but then the, the, the right after that, yeah, he's, uh, very, very comes up very, very quickly. I think that's where Colin crashed a while back. Uh, but yeah, tricky going. For you, how was it? Uh, yeah, it was okay. Just the tires were completely shot at the end. Like I had no grip, and the screen missed it up, and I couldn't see anything for the last three k. So he's had that for three kilometers. There's some brute force happening yeah. to try and pull this car out. <laughs> It is rallying, isn't it? You can be out front and it can all change. That was the Colin McRae corner that our commentators were talking about there. Is there anything that you've seen on it? We are just having a look at it. Is, is there anything? There's literally nothing there that stands out that could have caused that. No, I mean, I'm sure the avid followers will have saw Elvin had a little bit of a moment there on the first pass, but uh, generally these guys are very aware of corners that catch people out. And, uh, you know, even I watched that one last week when you guys put it out on social media with Colin. So it's obviously a corner that can catch people out um, and it, I don't know you know these guys know the pace notes very well and they know the road conditions very well and uh, yeah just like I say very surprised to see Craig off the road and um, yeah, it's completely gutting for everybody involved because uh, that was a, another fantastic opportunity for result this weekend and, um, and for Craig it's certainly gone now. I mean, Craig can do it. Like, it, it. Talking about that first run through, I know obviously this stage, Julian was sort of talking about the fact that this stage suits your car in particular, but he can do it. There's there's no question that he can lay down the times. It's just, it seems to just not be clicking. Yeah, I mean, he proved that for the first three stages, um, you know, in, in, in the lead at, uh, this morning.